I am a tinkerer or a maker. My aim is to develop tools and gadgets to help alleviate poverty. My name is Dominic Wanjehia. I can always see situations where there's a hardship or something, and I can always design a solution for it. A Maasai elder called me Juju Man or wizard. His community believed it was magic. In developing Africa, 95% of the populations are reliant on wood fuel. In the old days, we used to collect firewood. In modern time, there is so little firewood around that the people in the village are now forced to cut down younger trees. It's a uh, taboo to cut down a food tree for firewood, but they just don't have a choice because there just is no more wood trees any anywhere around. If we can take that pressure off the forest, the forest will have a chance to survive. We have something so unique, something that hasn't been done before, something that can make an impact on people's lives all over the world. It's not, it's not just a localized um, solution that we're, that we're producing here. What we've created is a synthetic stomach. It's an animal without the body, if you may. You can feed it anything, like cow dung and pig dung and human dung. Shit in one end and gas out the other end. It's a very, very simple system to operate. So basically, the digester is a longitudinal diaphragm or tube on the ground, where you're feeding it from one end and it's flowing across the system and exiting from the other side. To enhance the temperature, we've encased our system in a greenhouse. So this greatly enhances the efficiency of the system. <laughs> Today, we are installing the FlexiBiogas technology. Our system is like a big suitcase. We train the user on how to load the system, how to load the dung. So the mixing ratio is uh, one to one. So half a bucket of dung, half a bucket of water. The owner of the digester always gets the honor to, take, to, to fill it, to put, pour it in the first bucket of cow dung. So we want at least four or 500 kilos of bio slurry in the system at startup. And then within three or four days, you are cooking. It actually was born through trying to assist the Maasai community. The Maasais believe that they are the owners of all the cows on the planet. Trying to convince them that they can turn cow dung into fire was very amusing in the beginning. They coined us kumbahus, and it means a stupid person. They did not believe that you could turn cow dung into fire. When the system did fire up and they saw the flames, we went from being kumbahus to a juju man. Juju man is a witch doctor or a wizard. Without electricity in rural areas, I mean, life is tough. This group have already gathered, they're already interested in seeing that system as soon as it fires up.
Um, my target is the individuals. And so my focus on all of the tools and the gadgets that I design are so that every individual can become independent. My aim is to eradicate poverty in Africa and other developing nations.